guys, it's Max from Players. Today we're at Will Press Europe in the depths of Essex, England. We're gonna check out all their brands and everything they have to offer for 2021. So let's go and have a look. So we're here with Jay. Um, you guys might have seen him on the channel before. He's been on there once or twice. He's gonna talk us through Will Pros Europe, what brands fall under the umbrella and what Will Pros is all about. So Will Pros LLC is the American um, company that is basically one of the biggest um, wheel manufacturers and distributors in the world. Um, and in the early part of this year, they decided to set up a European hub distribution center and um, kind of headquarters. Uh, they asked if I would be interested in doing that with them, um, coming on board. Obviously I said yes, the idea of being involved with such a massive company, doing something that I love and starting something from the ground up really appealed to me. So yeah, um, obviously I know a lot of the brands, obviously one in particular, which is Rotoform, which I've known since day one when Brian and Jason started it. Um, Will Pros itself has got sort of, I think it's about 23 brands in total, ranging from Rotoform to Foos, all the way to wheels that you can put on your golf car. Okay. Uh, they also own stuff like Power Sports, which is for UTV vehicles and stuff like that. We're primarily only working with kind of six or seven of the brands over here because we don't need all of the truck brands. We don't, obviously don't need golf cart wheels here. We can still get them yeah. and bring them in from the States for customers, mm. but we don't stock them. Um, here we're stocking Rotoform, KMC, XD, Asante Black Label, um, US Mags, American Racing, some Power Sport stuff, some Gorilla Lug Nuts, which is another business that Will Pros own. So, yeah, there's plenty of stuff here. Um, and yeah, we've got the ability to take 24,000 wheels here. We'll probably be running at a kind of 20,000 normally in stock, and we can offer next day delivery pretty much most places in Europe. In Europe? Yeah. Okay, not just England. No, UK so wide. this is to serve the UK and the whole of Europe. Okay, cool. Um, so we have sales guys upstairs that look after the UK. We've got sales guys in, based in Europe that kind of look after that and I just generally oversee everything. Okay, cool. So if you guys need any wheels, Jason Man, contact your distributor and he'll get shipped out. Um, so do you want to talk us through some of, maybe show us some of the wheels that we've got in stock? Yeah, so this might look a, kind of a little bit random in that you've got one brand here, one brand there, but because it's all kind of run off computers, we, everything is done through guns and those guns tell the guys where the wheels are. So even though it looks random, everyone, the computers know where all the wheels are. Mm -hmm. So if the guys upstairs sell four rotiform RSEs, mm -hmm. that comes down to the gun there. The gun then tells the guys where it is. They get them their pickers and they go off and pick them. So although it looks random, there is complete- There's method to the madness. There's, there's complete method to it. Um, so yeah, Rotoform is obviously our biggest brand in Europe at the moment. Um, closely followed um, by Fuel, which is, uh, again, I believe is the biggest truck brand, truck wheel brand yeah. in the world. And that's a huge sort of market now in the UK and in Europe with everybody buying trucks, but also we've actually um, put in a few fuel designs into uh, production for transporters because the whole Swamper looks like a real big deal now. Um, so those two are our biggest brands at the moment, but we also do a lot of XD, um, a lot of American racing, which is kind of very big, weirdly in like um, Sweden and Norway okay, and that yeah, part. Yeah, so. like they love the old American stuff along with US mags. This is the sort of stuff you'd see on your retro American cars. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, but also American racing, probably not a lot of people know, but they do a lot of new stuff as well for like the new um, Mustangs oh, okay. and the newer sort of Chargers and that. But in a um, vintage sort of vibe, but a Yeah, but no, they do also do kind of like old. normal, like newer stuff. Okay. But yeah, it is primarily the vintage that we sell at least mm -hmm. because we're dealing with this kind of custom shops. And then you've got XD, 
which is another huge brand. These are kind of like sort of standard 22 cast wheels. Standard um, 22s. I mean, these are 22 by 10s um, with like a negative 12 offset. You know, it's, uh, it's crazy some of the stuff they do. Some big boy numbers. So we can bring in like, Various customers might want brand, another brand that Wheel Pros have is Moto Metal. It's not one that we stock a lot of here, mm -hmm. um, but again, we can those type of brands we can bring in at any point, and that's just another huge 22. 22 by 10, yeah. again. Jeez. You look at this warehouse now and you think, there's not a lot of wheels here, there's 6,000 wheels in this warehouse, which is more than probably any other warehouse that's got in the UK. Okay. By mid-January, this will be like I say, sitting at about 19, 20,000 wheels. And is that what you envision will be the range of brands that land or? Yeah, I mean, obviously it's, there's always been a market here um, and it's just a case of learning what people want in stock. We can often kind of, you know, if you call up on a Monday and you want to set wheels that we don't have in stock, but we've got them in the States, we can get them to you by Wednesday, Thursday. Um, but we want to make sure that we can try and service all of Europe with 90% of what they they want, which we're kind of there now. We've, we're in a very good position where if we haven't got it, we can get it. And even if there, even if there's customers that want stuff that isn't available, if there's enough demand, we can get it made. Make it. Like, for instance, the stuff we've done with fuel mm. for the transporters like some of the transporter specific stuff that we've done with Rotaform. Because in America, they don't get the transporter. Over here, it's a huge market. And, you know, it makes sense to have certain wheels load rated for that, certain wheels made for it. And the Swamper look is a huge... If you know. guys don't know the Swamper look, just Google it. Swamper look, transporter. But yeah, load rating is a big... Yeah, it's, it's a, a, big, it's a move, big thing. Big move. And the fuel stuff, all of that's already load rated because okay. it's like all of that stuff's built trucks. for like huge American mm. trucks. Yeah, so just to summarize with the brands that you have in stock, so we would say fuel is the brand that sort of appeals to, I know it's for the trucks, the off road. Um, so yeah, on. fuel is all of the trucks, all of the Jeeps, um, obviously stuff for transporter now. Um, but yeah, anything from a 17 up to like 24 if you want it. Uh, and that's something that obviously that's on the shelf ready to Yeah, go. we've got um, most of their stuff in from kind of 17 up to 22. But again, if you want something crazy like what we, that I'll show you later, um, we can we can get them from the States in, in a few days. Cool. Um, then we've got the XDs. What would the X, what would the XD and KMC be? tends to be a bit more um, Jeep based. Okay. Um, but again, you, you you know we've got the fitments for um, trucks like the Hiluxes, the Rangers, also vans. We've got XD on our delivery van, um, so you can get stuff for your transit, okay, cool. stuff for your sprinters. Um, we touched on American racing being not just the old school American vibe, but obviously that brought up to the new school as well as new styles. Yeah, so, so American racing again. It, We've got everything from, if you want something for a Wrangler, a Jeep Wrangler, all the way back to a C10, like pickup truck, all the way up to a brand new, you know, um, Mustang. Okay, cool, yeah. And obviously, the green boxes. Yeah, and Rotaform. So, so most people who are obviously watching this probably know Rotaform. Um, an American brand that is huge in the European market, not just selling in the European market, but was built around the European vehicles, the VWs, the Audis. The VAGs. Um, yeah, yeah, that kind of thing. And we've got, one of the things that we've done, simply because we've been able to, we've got the space and the power to be able to do it, is to bring back some of the old styles. So like, the, the wheel that kicked it all off was the BLQ. Mm -hmm. um, and that's, you know, that's over 10 years ago now. Um, and yeah, we've, we've brought it that back. Like on, um, uh, Audi A6 bag to my room in Brian. Yeah, so the first so... car that they ever went on, yeah. um, the story is that Brian contacted Elliot from uh, Performance mm -hmm. VW and Elliot suggested a car that um, Carl, obviously mm -hmm. um, my business partner, 
and Darren Bennett were putting together when we were working down at um, down at his place at G Works, and it was uh, a white Mark IV bagged, oh, and it was painted Bentley. Oh, it was a white Bentley yeah. colour. Anyway, and that was the first car, and we took it to Old McDubbs, and it blew up. And yeah, from there, it kind of just went crazy. Perfect wheel, perfect price point, fantastic quality. And we've brought that wheel back over here. It's always been available in the States, but we've been able to get it here. So people, will, there's, you know, there's a generation of car sort of guys that don't even know that wheel. Yeah. So we've got that. We've also got the newer updated version, which is the BLQC. And we can, we've got, again, pretty much any rotiform cast style. We've got it here. We've got new stuff coming out. We've got six new designs coming in the, which we're going to go through in a distant second. future. And again, everything from 17s up to the JDR, which is a 22. Okay, okay, yeah, so that's sick. So um, obviously, most of the guys probably tuning in right now will recognize the Rotiform brand, but now we've been introduced to a whole new range of brands uh, under the Wheel Pro umbrella. I didn't know, I heard of Fuel, um, but all the other brands are, you know, new to me, and I'm glad that obviously, Jay, you could show us around um, your warehouse, thanks for that. Yeah, no problem. It's really uh, eye-opening. And the vast size of this, I'm not sure if we can quite get on camera, but the size of this place, the height, I mean. Yeah, I mean, it's very clever the way it's been designed so that we use the same pickers that Amazon use. So they're guided by these wires in the floor. So you can go so much higher and so much tighter. Um, the guys at Wheel Pros, you know, this is a big one. This is like over 20,000 square feet. Um, which you can see how big it is, but they've got ones in the States that are 350,000 square feet. You can't begin to imagine the size. The of, scale of Yeah, the scale operation. of the company, the scale of what, what, the amount of wheels they can stock. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's incredible. Uh, so shall we go and have a look at some of your Rotoform 2021 styles yeah. coming out? Yeah. Cool. Let's have a look. Let's go. So we have here a display of wheels so um i don't know maybe we'll start with a fuel wheel yeah so this gives you an idea of sort of the craziness of what you can do with fuel and these are off the shelf cast wheels 22 by 10s comes in this crazy fitment in this crazy finish um you know and we've got them on on the shelf um this is one of their really popular designs in the states um, you know, and you can see this kind of like concave on it. It's, so deep. It's incredible. One of the other companies that we own is ReadyLift, which oh, okay. make um, lift kits for obviously mainly, again, US trucks, but they also do stuff for the Hilux, for the Ranger. So like my truck that we use here has got a three inch um, ReadyLift kit on it. So we're gonna see how big a wheel and tire okay, combination okay. we can get on yeah. there. And yeah, we've obviously got the problem with the poke that we're not technically allowed, but we'll see how far we can go. Yeah, we can just push it. And how, how, so how small this wheel with this crazy concave, how small do they go? So that they one goes all the way down to 18. 18 by... And it'll be 18 by nine. Okay, cool. So they're all quite wide. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, an 18 by nine is, is fine on a normal UK truck because of the way the offsets work. Yeah. They don't poke. Because um, we, uh, we also carry a lot of kind of plus 35 offsets, which is what you really want to use. But we can also run a nine minus 15, which is what's on my truck, which frankly only sort of pokes that much. So it's- If the police are watching, it doesn't poke. Yeah, so we, we can get away with it. Um, and we've kind of got all bases covered. And then the other stuff that you can see here is, this is obviously one of the uh, right from forged that would be running a center lock. There's a BUCM there, a six, and one of the new uh, cast designs, the DTM in the black with the new spline caps that we're uh, now running on most of the new Rotoform cast stuff. Yeah, so um, yeah, no, that's really cool. This is obviously two um, styles that we've come to, you know, know and love. Um, you know, it's really interesting with this fuel designs, and then we've got some. You've got what an XD, and is that what? Yeah. American so over racing. here, yeah. So down here, we've got an American Racing. Um, 
this is kind of like um, the vintage look, but for newer uh, vehicles. And then we've got the XD. This is a new design from XD, which I absolutely love. Again, we carry these in stock for, you know, again, UK style trucks um, in a 20. And then, yeah, uh, right form forged again, which we obviously yeah. do here as well. This, this, this is, I, I love this um, sort of diamond cut, but not with a dark color on the black. Like a super movie, yeah, you know. Yeah, and it's it looks it looks really expensive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're not crazy money at all. You know, that's what I think is really good. People look at stuff like the fuel and the XD, and they're like, oh, that must be so expensive. And it's really not. Especially when you see them on a truck. Uh, for some reason, at least for me, I always thought truck stuff was like yeah because it all, I mean, it's always bigger wrong. and it's always whatever like you know. it can get really expensive if you go forged and bead lock and stuff mm. like that but, but this on a day-to-day -to, -day -day day -to -day, that's you know that's i can tell you now that's sort of the equivalent to a set of um replacement toyota wheels it's ridiculous why would you go with that exactly yeah just so you know if you want to come for a meeting here you very well taken care of. We try to cover all, all needs. So another one of the brands that um, Wilpros has is uh, Niche, which for me is, I really like that brand. It's kind of sits between sort of rotor form. Um, it does a lot of very similar cars, like very European, but it also, this is a brand that we'll have that will stock a lot of stuff for Porsches. Okay, so yeah. 991s, 992s, 997s. Um, in, they'll be in stock, various um, designs. Also kind of a lot more Range Rover stuff. We're, again, we're working with the designers on sort of specific vehicles for- Oh, a luxury yeah, new yeah, feel to, yeah. to the wheel. Velva, niche. Yeah, exactly. I love what, See what, what we've done there, yeah, yeah. clever. Uh, and there's another one of the new, um, very popular new designs, the HUR, um, which was a super popular forged design that then got put into cast, and we've got that in, we do that in a silver and a black as well. Silver and then the big news at the moment is the KB1, which is the Ken Block signature wheel. Um, which I think is really is fantastic. I love the kind of almost fanned element on the side. Yeah. Um, and Ford is is a market that has missed out on certain wheels, and this you know is obviously it's designed for everyone. But Ken Block is a big Ford guy, yeah. and the guy and the Ford guys absolutely love this wheel. I, I love that wheel. What a fantastic. Would that come in, obviously, all your 108 fitments? Yes, yeah, so it's coming in 108, 5x112, 120. So oh, okay, it, it still range. covers all of the VAG stuff. Um, but obviously, it's, it does cover a lot of the Ford guys. And that comes in uh, 19s. OK, cool. Sweet, yeah. Look forward to those. And these are, I guess, now the other So this new... is the stuff that we're getting in the early part of next year. Um, we've got some of these here um, in the next sort of two weeks, but not a lot, but the main bulk of these arrive kind of end of January. So you've got the LHRM, again, with a new covered uh, center with the spline caps, um, the DTM and the BLQC. So that goes back to what I was yeah, talking about earlier. Um, and we've got it down there in Anthracite. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, that looks, that, yeah, that's sick. Uh, this one, we're doing them in other sizes as well now, so they're coming in staggered 20s, um, which, I mean, this for me is a great wheel. Yeah, it's, it's Like that on your sort of Golf R's all the way up to your RS6s, which... I think, yeah, I think on a, on a big car, look, you know, big size, I don't know if you can quite pick up just the kick of the spoke right here. Maybe we didn't pick it up in the black one, but this one really shows. It's got a really nice profile to it. Um, and that center lock vibe is really like motorsport. I know you're doing it in all of the wheels, but it yeah. really, 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 really sits well there, I think. Um, this this is so intricate um, of a, yeah, of a the, wheel. The amount of work that goes into a wheel like that is incredible. This, this is, and this is a great finish. This is actually similar finish to what 
um, I've just ordered on one of my cars, which is kind of the the uh, satin black centers with the gloss black. I wonder lips. What, what one of your cars would suit a black wheel. Don't know. I'll wait and see. Um, but yeah, any one that works, which is none of them at the moment. <laughs> they look great in the Corolla. Um, so yeah, and then we've got last few um, wheels here for. Yeah, again, more uh, rotor form. Full stuff, so that's Fulls Monoblock, uh, and then both three piece ZMOM, which is this is pretty crazy. Pretty cool. I love um face mounted hidden hardware wheel. Um, yeah, it works. Um, on, it's, on certain applications, I love something like that where it's all black and then you've got the hardware on show just kind of break it up mm -hmm. but yeah i mean that and this with the motorsport sort of window stuff pockets, yeah and then obviously the hidden hardware at the back um that's that's really cool and then obviously the hidden again the, the center nut um, yeah these nuts <laughs> Got <it! laughs> are these the nuts like the what's so no these them? these are the older style nuts, nuts. um or caps, as we mm -hmm. should call them, really, not nuts. We can talk about nuts if you want, but <laughs> they're actually caps. Um, no, so all the new ones are coming with the uh, new metal spline caps, which are really, really cool. Uh, and then some of the new KMC designs. Yeah, that's very Again, cool. in really good fitments, really good uh, finishes, and all cast, all on the shelf. Yeah, this is good. Um, Jay, thank you very much for showing us around. No uh, worries. We can't, but we'll yeah, air fist. Technically like that, yeah. Um, COVID. But yeah, so guys, this is obviously been a real cool walk around of Wheel Pros Europe with Jay um, all around the warehouse. We learn about the brands that Wheel Pros are holding in Europe. Um, the brands that obviously Jay mentioned that they could get if you had a really cool golf cart. Um, but apart from that, you know, the guys are hard at it See, look, anyway. Working. Hard so working guys, non, uh, non-stop. We've, um, but I'm really interested about the rotor form. I know I'm a bit biased. I'm not a four by four wheel guy, but I'm really interested in obviously all the rotor form stuff. Um, the new styles look sick. So if you guys are interested, contact obviously your distributor of uh, rotor form or fuel or any other brand. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much, Jay. No problem. Guys, we'll catch you next time.